our Father and our God, our Father through our Lord Jesus Christ. We thank you for this bright new day. Thank you for your presence. Thank you for your blessings upon our lives. Accept our thanksgiving. Father, you brought us from eternity and you put us in time in order to have influence, in order to influence our world for you. And so today we pray that we shall influence our world positively. We decree and command grace to rest upon us so that we carry your influence wherever we go. In the name of the Lord Jesus, today we shall be positive influences in all that we do. No power shall diminish your influence in our lives. No power shall erase your image in our lives. You commanded us in your word to be fruitful. And so today we receive grace to be fruitful. Grace to be productive. Grace to be prolific. We receive grace to multiply, to reproduce good things, goods and services that will be beneficial to mankind. We receive anointing to replenish the earth, to be distributors of your goodness. We receive grace to subdue the earth, to dominate for you, and to have dominion. In the name of the Lord Jesus, you said in your word, this is the day which the Lord has made. We agree with you. We say this is the day which you have made. A day of joy, a day of satisfaction, a day of safety, a day of salvation, a day of prosperity. Lord, we know plans may change, but your purpose is permanent. And so we decree today, your purpose will be fulfilled in our lives. Lord, today... We decree that your seed in us will not die. Your seed in us will not die. Your seed will germinate. You will bring to us people who will motivate us. People who will make us think big. Dream big. People who will assist us to germinate the seed you have sown into us. We decree that your seed in us will not be wasted. Your spirit, the Holy Spirit, will water the seed in us so that it will constantly develop in the name of the Lord Jesus. Bring to us people that will fertilize the plant that you have planted in our lives so that the plant you have planted we be fresh and grow unto maturity. You will bring the sunshine of your grace to shine upon us. In the name of the Lord Jesus Christ, Lord, we pray that today you will visit us with your majesty. You will visit us with your mighty hands. In the name of the Lord Jesus Christ, I pray, Lord, our case will not be like the case of Sodom and Gomorrah. We will not be destroyed. We will not do things that will bring your anger upon us. None of us shall end our lives like Saul, the first king in Israel. In the name of the Lord Jesus, give us grace to heed your warnings. Give us grace to follow you fully. Give us grace to destroy the Amalekites in our lives. In the name of Jesus, help us to raise for you an altar of sacrifice. In the name of Jesus, Lord, help us to avoid distractions today. 
help us to be focused on you in the name of the lord jesus let your glory rest on us let your power rest on us let your anointing rest on us let your presence rest on us heavily release unto us heavy blessings from your presence so that our lives shall continually sing Hosanna to you that people will see, see us and sing Hosanna to you you will make our lives today and even after today to be hallelujah from the crown of our head to the sole of our feet in the name of the Lord Jesus Christ we pray that today you will fulfill prophecy in our lives. You will bring to pass what you have said concerning us. Thank you, Heavenly Father. Blessed be your name. In Jesus' name, we pray. Amen, amen, and amen.